So, hey guys, Chauso here. So yeah, I got to level 31 in the Kizuna, so I figured I'd showcase the team I'm using. Since yeah, I do have the new Yaj, I do have one point booster apart from the uh, Capone crew, so I had to edit the team building a bit. <clears throat> I did settle to keep the Wii to Kaido. In the end, it definitely not needed, but nice extra damage. And like, he has the page one support, which is useful for this stage, so yeah, it's not a big deal. But yeah, we removed two turns of attack down here, so the remaining two is gone for final stage. Then I just use Moria and Kaido. To get enough damage to one hit KO with Capone Crew through Barrier, even with the attack down. And yes, yeah, you see now at level 31, Katakuri here, Sai gets Rainbow Shield and Death Up. Capone Crew removes the Rainbow Shield. Jerma removes the Spear, gives Ore Boost. And uh, Rare Recruit Queen removes the death buff and gives a chain lock. So yeah, very easy kill still. Like all of these two, a lot of damage. I'm not sure exactly how much, but it's quite substantial. So yeah, moving on to the int variation. And yeah, int is pretty straightforward for this team. Like stage 2 is basically nothing, like stage 2 just tries to blow away, so you resist that with Capone Crew. Just use Moria to get matching orbs, or boost, and we can easily move on to final stage. And it's nice to have more surprise specials for this as well. Just, just go through stage one as quickly as possible. Yeah, very straightforward. And of course, by using Moria at this stage, we do get his color affinity final stage, which pairs well with the attack boost from Capone Crew and Orb boost from Jerma. And yeah, Katakuri here gets a death up shield at level 32. But yeah, we'll handle that with Queen Special, just the same as we did against Sai. So yeah, this is basically the same as the side variation, same specials. And yeah, we get to see a bit of the damage output. We managed to do 88 million, that's just hitting with uh, two super effective hits. We have two more from Capone Crew and uh, Summer Big Mom. But yeah, despite all that, the most damage we do is easily against Strength, and that's because of the uh, we took Kaido on the team. But yeah, this was still the most annoying stage to team build for. I decided to opt for the approach to two turn the second stage. Because dealing with both the bind and then the paralysis final stage, yeah, it's kind of rough. So yeah, the way we're doing it is basically that we have the Otama support on Big Mom. So we remove two turns of bind, only one left. One turn is fine to stall here. All Flampe does is put up burn, and burn is just completely useless here. Ooh. 
Yeah, easy kill. And yeah, we can just launch every special now against the final stage here. We already have the color affinity from Moria. Use Capone crew, we get the attack boost. Germa gives the ore boost. Queen gives the chain lock. And then Big Mom removes the paralysis. And Kaido gives increased damage taken. And yeah, it's going to be a big increase. Yeah. Kaido alone did almost 150 million damage. So. <laughs> and we had two more super effective hits from Jerma and Capone Crew. But yeah. That's it from me, this Kizuna. I hope you all managed to get to box 7. So yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. See you next time.